The Ministry of Finance and the Public Service is committed to contributing to the economic growth and sustainable development of Jamaica. And the ease of doing business with government entities and delivering quality service is integral to the overall well-being of our nation. People, yes, the people, are the foundation of every organization. Once they deliver a high level of service, now the quality of the service for the entire organization will be achieved. So here are the stories of those who continue to deliver excellent service. It's a great feeling knowing that the ministry can recognize somebody who day to day they have put out their all and at the end of the year they can say well done. When I just came in the ministry in 2002, I was assigned to the auxiliary staff and I wanted to know more and to, to reach more. So what I did, I go back to school, I did some subjects and I passed all the subjects that I did and I was moved to records management. Every day, someone would come up to me, especially the auxiliary staff, and they will say, you know that you motivated me. I am going to go to school, I'm not gonna stop. And so this gives me a good feeling inside, knowing that I can even help them and encourage them to do their best. What motivates me to strive for excellence is setting targets and exceeding the targets, knowing that at the end of the month, I can give a report and that report is good. Shanika is a family person, she's a wife and a mother of one and she sees the family is very important and in my spare time my best place to hang out is at home. By being organized and practicing to handle family and work I'm able to balance that and I have my family support that backs me up when I'm not strong enough. I am a person that likes to work behind the scene. I do not like to be the subject. However, a word from H. Jackson Brown, do not work for recognition, but do a work that is worthy of recognition. This has helped me to embrace the award and it felt really, really good to be recognized. And I'm happy to be recognized in this way. I am motivated by my passion for excellence and my respect for commitment and dedication. I don't know if a lot of people do this, but I plan ahead in order to arrive at work early. When I arrive at work early, I am able to relax and prepare or organize for the day. I started um, Ministry of Finance in 2006. I started um, as the statistician, then I moved through the ranks. I went to um, econometrician and um, then acted as um, Director of International Trade and uh, right now I am the Director of International Trade. The achievements here at the Ministry, right, my performance in particular, is, is one that comes because of who I am and what I stand for. I have certain principles, I have core principles which actually guides me. Uh, one of which is to say, do unto others as you'd want them to do unto you. So therefore, whatever you put your hand to, you're going to just give 150%. I'm just motivated, I'm a positive individual, right? And I believe that persons around you, they need somebody to look up to. So I try to live life to the fullest, and in doing so, try and achieve as much as I can. And so I can actually impart and coach others to reach such standards. I'm a honest, hard-working public sector worker who has over 33 and a half years behind him, working or endeavor to do his best in his chosen field of endeavor, management analysis. And my predecessors, those that have followed before me, have pushed me, have motivated me to step up to the plate, to give my best to a public sector, to a Jamaican public that craves good, honest, hard work as a hallmark 
of our public sector. I work and set myself targets. I want to be an example, a motivational example to all that are my colleagues around me. I lead a team and as such I have to set the, the, the pace and the trend in that team. I also believe in values, core values that we strive. We align our values to the values and goals of the ministry to achieve personal and professional objectives critical to the growth and development of Jamaica. The people here and the people before me were all hardworking, were all dedicated public servants. This has endeavored to push me to create a, an environment that fosters growth and development, learning new things, new um, formulas for success. These are you know, um, things that have pushed me over the years to try and push to the limit of my, my um, existence. I think my co-workers would be inspired if I continue to challenge myself to do my best and to lead by example. Keep setting the target to go above and try to reach the goal that you have set. Try not to limit yourself and try to be motivated by something. Something have to motivate you. Think of yourself as a sales rep. Think of yourself as a product. And so whatever you showcase, that's what the world is going to see. Me being here is an example to them. Strive for excellence in no matter what they're attempting to do to be the best, to work hard, dedicate, to be the best. You've heard their stories, stories of intrinsic motivation, commitment, dedication, and consistency. We have the opportunity to be excellent. You have the opportunity to be excellent. So let us continue to work together through united efforts to raise the bar of excellence as we continue to provide service to this great nation of Jamaica land we love.